Ladies and gentlemen, if you haven't already, please click the subscribe button, and if you're feeling extra crazy, drop a like and turn those notifications on. Okay, I, I, wow, that was a good start. Welcome back everyone, uh, today is day 4 of the 10 days of Christmas and you know what that means, okay we've done Playstation, we've done Xbox, we've done Amazon, we're now upping the levels and we're back to Playstation, in today's episode we are giving away a £25 PSN code voucher thing, it's going to pop up on screen somewhere during this video, Biscuit is very good at hiding these so you have to have a keen eye to find these codes, okay and obviously if you want to get the next code you know what to do by now, make sure you subscribe with those notifications turned on because it's first come first serve for the code and also we're getting ever so close to 200,000 subscribers can we do it by new year's eve that's the goal so please click the subscribe button but in today's episode i'm excited as you can see on the right hand side there is a foot freeze politano he looks unreal like legit he looks so so good i want him i really want him and not only that he gets a strong link to lozano who you all know i love lozano i bring him on every game at half time and if i get 86 red lozano he's in the team of the week if i get him we're going to be doing this politano this episode uh and even if we don't get him i have his 85 in form who is tradable so basically the the, the goal today is to get lozano my red pick so i can sell my 85 and so i have the 86 red permanently and then get politano because politano looks really really good but before we do division rivals and foot champions foot freeze challenge for a mega pack what is it what is it involved tell me maximum four leagues Players from the same nation, maximum five. Players from one club, max minimum minimum three. Red players, two. 77 rating. Right, I can do this. Boom. We've done it very easily. Look at that. Fantastic. 77 rated, 96 chemistry. We did 95. We get a untradeable mega pack to start off this episode. And then obviously we've got gold three foot champion rewards. And also to check if there's no more. Okay, just checking there's no more foot free challenges. Obviously, we've got division rivals. We have finished division one rank two. But the mega pack to start off this episode. Go on, untradeable mega. Let's get a good one. Hey, there's a board. We'll take a board every day of the week. Go on then. Oh no, Newcastle. Yes, and for me, he is, or Dubravka is a duplicate. So that's not good. And if you're wondering uh, what the team is looking like at the moment, this, nope, this is the team I was using as the 77 Prem for managerial masterpiece to get ourselves Balassi. First team is looking like this. So as you can see, if we did get Politano and Lozano, they're just slipping right here. Because a lot of you are saying, Theo, why are you playing David Beckham? He's very good at passing, but yes, he is slow. Um, and obviously Nedved on the left-hand side has replaced Dembele for now. But let's get into Division Rival Rewards, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to be taking the untradables because why not? Four ranking mega packs or the trade are two rare mega packs we're going to say the untradeables because it seems like my untradeable packs that is where i get the luck obviously we got informed son last week so can we get something good from these four untradeable rare mega packs in the first one what are we going to get also next week i'm going to try and get division one rank one for the ultimate pack is that a libertadores player it is so there could be something semi-decent in this pack hiding is there going to be there is not unfortunately any duplicates Ede Militao, I mean, that would have been great at the beginning of FIFA. The second rare mega pack. Here we go, here we go. What's it gonna be, mate? Anything good? Walk out, maybe not. Ah, it's a board, it's an informed board. Go on, hit me. Where they? Oh, wait, is that Zahavi? Zahavi? Am I right? No. Weissman! I tell you what, for an 81 rated player, that those stats are actually not the worst in the world. I mean, informed board. 81 rated, you, you know we always need informs to go into SBCs, untradeable, so that's useful. 83 Strakosha, Zinedine Zidane as well at the end of the pack. The penultimate rare mega pack from the untradeable division rivals is a go. Walk out, go on, hit me, walk out, go on. No walk out board, no board. That's not good, we're going to skip this one because we don't want to see stinkers. Who's it going to be? 82, Gossen, Didivalvi, Rakitic, Hamdala, who had a... I was going to say I had a decent team of the season card last year, but it wasn't really, was it? Here we go. The final division rival reward is the last rare mega pack. What are we going to get? Walk out. Go on. Okay. We well, it's a Libertadores card, so there could be something in it. Could be a little Mbappe just waiting behind this Libertadores card. Oh, 85 rated Leno. I'll take that. Yeah, that's good fodder. I will take an 85 rated Leno. Anything at the end of the pack? Not really. So there we go. Foot Champions is up next. Now I, I really, really, really want Lozano. He is like, ah, 
That's my dream card right there, Lozano, getting that in from Lozano. I will also take a, a Tavernier right back. Um, you know, English links of Joe Gomez, slightly better than Hector Bellerin, I think. So you get 30,000 coins, which will push us over the million coin barrier again. Two mega packs, one 50k pack, and two foot champion player picks. Come on then! We want Lozano or Tavernier! Lozano, Lozano, Lozano. Hit me with a Lozano! Hey! That is weirdly incredible. I think he's the is he not the highest rated team of the week he's only 70k don't get me wrong he's only 70k but that is the highest rated team of the week card this week so that's actually a dub royale that is a dubbington bear they call it um even though as i said he's 70k 89 rated tony cruz fodder absolute fodder fc i can't complain with that i cannot complain all i lead now it's Lozano, and I have had the week and a half of dreams. Come on, hit me with a Lozano. Hit me with a Lozano. Yeah. No Lozano. That's annoying. We'll take a Carlos Soler, who actually, once again, has they're decent stats. They are decent stats for a centre midfielder, you know. Building our icon swap team two for La Liga. Always useful. Cruz, Carlos Soler. Uh, 84 rated. May as well take him. So no Lozano, which is a little bit disappointing. But as I said, we still have a second in form, 85 rated. But Tony Cruz, I can't be disappointed, as I said. And then, of course, we've got some packs. We've got 50k and two mega packs. Come on, then. In the mega pack, we know we, we still could, put, we could, we could pack a Lozano still. Not on this one. No board, no walkout. So we'll give that a little skipping to bear. Who is it going to be? Who's in the pack? These are tradable as well. So we'll keep all them. We will then... Oh, a thousand coins as well. Holstenberg, Hulk. You'd love to see it. The last foot champion. Mega pack. Here we go then. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Is there gonna be anything decent? Give me a walkout. No walkout. Give me a board. No board. Oh no. Well, the two, two foot champion mega packs were not fantastic. I can't be lying to you. Alex Moreno, Fabian Delph, Lilana, the boys. Mm -hmm. What about the tradable 50k? Are we gonna get some more good? Come on, hit me with the tradable 50k, lads. Come on. Come on, it's ain't good, it's ain't good. Go on. Oh, it's a walkout, it's a walkout, it's a walkout. Be Mbappe. Oh, it's Handanovic. Handanovic. Oh, Black, even better. Even better. 91 rated of Black. That is, wow, this has actually been, this has been a good rewards video. Six, he's, again, he's 70k, same price as Tony Cruz. There could be something good hiding in this pack as well. A little dangler royale. There's an inform Martinez. Yeah, absolutely love to see it. Oh, why did Arsenal let Martinez go? So that's an easy 10k for Martinez. Or Black, we are going to keep because he's going to help reduce the price of Politano by a shed load. So Or Black, we will keep and put him into Politano because realistically, he's not going to fit in my team with Joe Gomez and Van Dyke And the rest of the players, we can say bye-bye to the quick sell. So let's go ahead and do the Politano card. I really want to try him out. I think he looks he looks class. Having him up front with Sami Eto will be unbelievable. And we'll put Son on the left. So yes, the chemistry may be a bit off and I don't know exactly how I'm going to work this team. But we'll come to that. We'll come to that in the future. So 85 rated squad. We'll put obviously Or Black in goal first. We might not even need him for an 85 rated squad. Like, I don't know what to do. Right, uh, I actually didn't really have the fodder in my club for this, even with the odd black. So it was a little bit, an 85 was a little bit more than I actually thought. The 83 is going to be very easy, but we're going to have to go out and buy ourselves a Gomez, who is currently about 22,000 coins. So it's not costing me that much. The 85, I don't know, with the odd black, who knows, who knows. But it's redu it helped reduce it quite a lot. So it's only costing me 20,000 coins with the odd black. So let's try and find a Gomez for 20,000. We've managed to snipe him, and that is the 85 Serie A side for Politano completed. We get ourselves a Prime Electric Players Pack, 12 items, 6 gold, 6 rares. Let's see if we can get something good to help us out in the 83. The 83 should be easy enough. We get a walkout. Oh, go on. Brazil left wing, left wing. Keeper. Edison. Wow. Okay. I think this is, this is the second time we packed Edison. Obviously, we've got Allison in goal at the moment for the Liverpool. Is it tradable? It's a tradable, Ed it's a tradable Edison. How much is he going for these days? Well, this rewards video has been really, really good in terms of fodder. 88 rated. Well, he's sell for 30, 40k. Um, we might. There's no point using him because an 83 rated score is very easy. No point using an 88 and an 83. But we do need to have a team of the week and a Napoli player in this. So what Napoli players have we got? I think we actually might have Politano if I didn't use him already. Obviously, we've got the Lozano. We've got Manalas. Fabian. Let's use Fabian. And Politano. 
get a little link there for us and let's try and do this with a team of the week player in there as well and there is the 83 rate it's scored very very easily done obviously we picked up this guy in our rewards so he's helped us use it uh, get the get the uh, the who is it Politano? Uh, we've used the Leno who we packed in today's episode as well. So a lot of useful fodder used in today's episode, and it's obviously only cost us a um, twenty thousand coins for who did we buy? I actually can't remember who we bought. Wow, it wasn't even that long ago as well. Either way, we got a gold pack to open before we get Politano. In fact, they've given us Politano before we gold pack. So there you go. Politano has been unlocked. Foot freeze, Politano. Welcome to the team. We're going to link him up with Lozano. And I'm hoping that this is a start of a brand new dream team. Let's get Politano in the club. And then we're going to open this gold pack that will be waiting for us in the store, if I'm not correct. There it is. All right, let's open this gold pack. Uh, 12, 12 golds, only one rare. So I doubt we're going to get anything good. You never know. You never know. Anything good? No. Right, let's get Foot Freeze Politano into the team. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? 85. Politano, there you are. Obviously, I don't think Tony Cruz is going to get in the side, but Politano is in the side, and he'll replace Mesa Mount, and then Bex can drop to the bench for Lozano. And there you go. We just need to convert Politano to a cam and work out how exactly the chemistry will work because we do have the likes of um, Correa who's been upgraded who looks pretty good as well or we just play him on 7 chem but then Son himself is on 5 chem so I don't really know what to do here because I do want Son in the team unless we do but then Mendy links to absolutely no one like if we did that and then that Kante's on 7 Nedved, and then Son doesn't play. Like, see the the issue we have here. Bit of a tricky one, I can't lie. And actually, not only is it a tricky one, um, Kante is going to be our only centre mid unless Nedved plays centre mid with Kante. Which, I mean, it's it's a it's a thing. I mean, this is just like my chemistry is all over the place here, isn't it? I don't know what I'm doing if I'm being honest. But who else have I got in the in the club? We have got Tony Cruz. We need another icon for the cat. We need another icon at centre mid, don't we, realistically? We need an icon at centre mid. We've got Malay. I mean, and Saudi Lo Lippmann. And no, I refuse to put him in. We've got Coleman on the left who could do a job. We'll get him in there. But realistically, what do we do? I actually don't know. Right, we decided to just have sacrifice the chemistry, and this is what we're going to play in game. So Politano is going to go up front with Eto. Uh, oh, God, I hate these controls. There you go, Politano's up front with Eto, uh, Nedved and Kante in centre mid, Lozano on the right, Son on the left, and just see if that is a thing until I can work out exactly what on earth I'm doing with, with this team, because I, there needs to be, uh, unless we sacrifice Mendy, like, all, we, all we'd have to do is put Son there, get a new left back, but... What left backs in the Prem would I use? That's the question, guys. Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. I need your help. But we're going to use this dodgy, dodgy chemistry side and get into a game. I'll tell you what. Actually, I've just I've just done this. This isn't even the worst. This. Let me convert everyone back to their positions now. I've, I think I might have cracked it, you know. Um, so we do, we'll do. just keep on centre forward for now. We'll put Son to a left winger. I mean, that gets everyone decent chemistry, doesn't it? Yeah, I think this is the best way to get the chemistry for the team and then still play that 4-4-2 in game. And the team we are up, up against... Wow, okay, wow, wow. Okay, wow. Ronaldo, Jao Felix, go to the sticks. Son, player of the month. Veron, look at that defence. It's insane. And D-Bex, what a side we are in for. Uh, gonna be a, well, it's going to be a tough game, isn't it? Oh, that's not a pen. There's no way that is a pen. I've just realised as well, I'm playing against a co-op team. There is no way that is a pen. Theo versus two. Are you going down the middle? David Beckham. Going down the middle. And yeah, okay. Okay, it's a goal. Right, so I'm 1-0 down against a co-op team with a very good side. But I just got to remember, Baker, you are good. You are very good. You just got to trust your abilities and try and beat the co-op. Ah! Oh. Oh, I've been ruined! Oh, I hate playing against co-op when you're a singular lad just trying to work his way through the FIFA world. The thing about co-op is, they can just block every route you want to take. Like, oh, he just blocks everything. Cause one will block and one will cut the passing lane. There's just nothing you can do. And especially when they've got players like Jao Felix, Ronaldo, Son. Like, this is an unbelievable team. Which makes it doubly as hard. 
Oh, come on, Baker. That's all right, Van Dyke. You sit son down. I just realized as well, I forgot to put a hunter card on Politano, who turns him into a bit more of a beast than he already is. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, please be on side. Oh, Sammy Eto in the back of the net, posting in. Wow, really unexpected goal, but luckily Eto's finishing is the greatest. Oh, I can't believe it. I can't believe how on earth have you hit the post and the ball comes back and it's just the perfectly weighted pass from the post into Son's feet. Oh, lads, please leave me alone. Co-op should face co-op opponents. Oh, look at that for a flipping cross. This is ridiculous. This is unfair. I love co-op. Don't get me wrong. Love it. One of the best things they introduced. But look, look how they bo both blocked the run. How is this fair? What a goal. Well done, Politano. He's good. He's really good. I'm enjoying Politano. Maybe losing 4-2, but... With a hunter, I reckon he's even better. I think what we're gonna do, bit of a bit of an outrageous one. We're gonna take Nedved off and bring him D Bex. They got Beckham. We're gonna have Beckham, and Beckham is gonna feed everyone. Oh, I... one person takes the corner. One person moves the player in the middle of the box, and it's impossible to defend against. How have I missed that? Oh, he's moved his keeper as well. He's moved the keeper. Blocked off the pass, but I should have scored that. There's no excuse. Go on, Beckham. Right on, Beckham. Oh, Veron. Mate, my head's completely gone with this game, you know. I think this game is a perfect example of why co-op should be in its own um, playlist. Because when you're against a co-op, it's just so hard. Like, sometimes it's easy, don't get me wrong. But when you get good co-op players like this, and they know how to block off everything... Like, how are you supposed to... Like, look at that! How am I possibly supposed to get past this guy when everything is blocked off? Right, so I lost 5-2, but... I did... It's frustrating because they weren't the best. They just worked very well as a, a, do, a duo in a co-op. And was, that was a prime example of why I think co-op should have its own division rivals. And foot champs, because co-op is so much fun. But, like, I was never going to beat them. I was never going to be them, which is heartbreaking. And I wanted Politano to have such a good debut. And yes, he scored a very good goal. Don't get me wrong. They did 2,223 skill rating. What was that? I can't even believe it. I can't even believe it. Right. We're going to end the episode there. Ladies and gentlemen, if you have enjoyed it, please drop a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, I, I definitely need a centimid icon, I think, just to fix up this chemistry. But I think that it's working. You know, the team is working like this for now. Either way, if you have enjoyed this episode, please be sure to drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, well done to whoever found the £25 PSN voucher. Tomorrow's £25 Xbox, so make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on. And speaking of that, I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye.